From the trainer summits and the ideas generated by the Believe team, we took those ideas back to the parks, talked about it with the in-house staff, and we put those sequences and those ideas into the emotional expressions that you'll see in the Believe show. We did this by complementing the wonderful talents of our internal entertainment team and animal training team by bringing in people from all around the country. We brought in a Broadway producer to help us establish what the overall content of the show would be. We brought in a set designer and a composer from Los Angeles area. And we also brought in a Hallmark Corporation to help us with what the emotional content of the show would ultimately be. The idea of Believe was actually born from the whale itself. As you can see from the whale tail behind me, from the behaviors that are in the show, and even the music that was composed in the show, it all came from the animal itself. The way they can move about the water, their finesse, their power, and their agility, it, it's indescribable. And I think that's one thing people never get tired of seeing. We as trainers, we never tire of it. We see it every day, but we appreciate it every day. These whales are amazing animals, and they brought with them the whole concept of this particular show. We have special jobs, and we recognize that, and we understand that we are, in essence, ambassadors for humankind interacting with this species of animal. Well, this particular board here is something we started with when, we, when the first concept of the show came to us. And this really is our heart and soul. We have seven, eight sequences, really, if you count testimony, but seven behavioral sequences that involve the whales. And we break each one down into each individual behavior. And what we started with was the first sequence, Shamu Alone. And we tried to marry behaviors to the feel of the music, the feel of the, the video, um, and it's so this is what we've come up with over the course of the last six to 12 months. There's behavior in the show where we turn all the sprayers on, and we get on the whale, and we zoom to the bottom of the pool, and we leap up out of the water, jump over the sprayers, come down with the whale, that's just plain fun. That's, that takes you back to the day where you first imagined wanting to get into the water with a killer whale. That's exactly the reason why we do this. Between sea and the shore Winding its way